hey, I just want to say that I'm better than I was earlier. I'm going to upload the video, though, that I made earlier about what I was going through at the moment. But my, also, the phone that I ordered doesn't work now. It just quit. Quit working. Screen's blotching. Totally crazy. Even though it was brand new. It was brand new in the box, but still... I got it through the generous donation money. By the way, don't mind the neighbor dog. Something's going on. I heard a sound. It sounded like a... Woo I don't know what, what it was. Woo like a wooing sound. But... Um, but the, the thing is, uh, I was going through that darkness of depression earlier and it, it's weird. It's that roller coaster of emotion. It's like you could have everything. You could be the richest person in this world and still have that problem. You could have it all. It's like, oh, you know, not be thankful. People say, be thankful, be thankful. That's not it. You know, it's not that you're not thankful that, I mean, I'm thankful every day, but I just want things to be better. And it's like, I want the suffering you see around us is just so much to take in. A lot of this world says, you've got it good. You need to be thankful, bro. What is, you're insane. You're crazy. You need to be thankful. Yes, I am. I mean, I thank heavens every day that, that, you know, for people like you, for that I'm with my parents, that I actually, that I, yes, that right now, I mean, I've got to, I've got to get a job sometime soon. But the point is that that's not, that's not what's causing that. It's what triggers. I don't know what triggers that. It's like a trigger. It's like a it's like a veil that is like pulling over you says, No, you're not. Like personal demons, these demons and these these this darkness inside you that won't let you be positive. And you have to try to fight it and struggle it, but it's difficult. And it's like you're losing what you are, and then it then it comes back. You're losing your all, but then it comes back. But it's, it's, um, people say that, you know, that emotional journey, that emotional struggle, uh, that you go through, it's like when you're going into that particular mode, you feel it and it's like, you know, you, you can't just snap out of it. There's no snapping out of that. You know, it's just like, it's like you have the realization of everything that, that there's so much suffering in this world. Someone came and asked us for help today. They were, they had nothing. They lost it all. They just lost everything. And it could happen to anyone. And seeing that suffering is bothersome. It hurts. And the fact that I was going through this, that darkness, depression, anxiety, and the suffering and pain. And it's not like, oh, uh, yes, p my parents, my daddy, he works for us, he provides. That's not the thing. It's not the thing that, you know, he does the best he can and that I try to stay here and help my mama. But that's not the, the, the thing is, I can have it as good as possible. But when that, it's, it's like your my vision gets dark. And I can't hardly see light. I can't perceive light. I can't hardly perceive light. It, it dims. And everything gets darker. And it won't let me think positive. And it's like, man, why does that have to happen? But then right now I'm a little bit better. And I can feel the emotional difference. And it's like up and down, up and down. That's why I call it a roller coaster. And now it's like I'm feeling slightly better. I'm still going to upload that video that I made earlier. But that's that'll be the part one. My phone went out. Uh, keep us in your prayers, though. At that time, Daddy called back. He's doing slightly, actually a lot better. He had to drink three cups of coffee, though, to be able to, which is not healthy. But he had to drink it to be able to uh, to drive and to be able to keep going because uh, and his computer's messing up, turning on and off. Every device seems to be messing up around me, on and off, and, uh, so, it's been crazy. What causes that emotional roller coaster? What causes that darkness and then up, heightened? Darkness and then heightened. And then all of a sudden you're fine and you're happy again, or as best you can be. It's just, and your vision's no longer dimmed, but people say, you've got, you've got it better than many people. You should, you should be... Thankful, thankful isn't it. It's not that I'm not thankful. That's not it at all. And, don't, I mean, you can't come from a perspective of not understanding and try to understand someone that's going through that emotional turmoil, that darkness, depression, anxiety, and struggle on the inside. 
you can have it all and still feel that pain. I don't have it all. I mean, we lack severely and struggle, but that's part of life. But it's just that, I mean, not as much as some. Yes, we have it better than some, worse than others. But it is just part of this journey. But I don't know where our soul is. It feels like the soul is supposed to be heading home. And sometimes it hurts that you go through this struggle, but... You go through the low parts, so you know how good, how good it feels to be at the high points, I suppose. Like I've stated before. But right now I can perceive that. I couldn't perceive that earlier. And I suppose you go through the darkness to know what it's like to be in the light. You go through the low points so you can appreciate the high points more when you get there, if you do. But Lord help us out. That's all I can say. I pray that things get better and that we all feel better because been feeling pretty crappy pretty cruddy sickness and all that stuff but it's been up and down um see my energy is causing everything to mess up it's like bing bing boom, boom like lights flickering uh things messing up around me electronics messing up just got that phone that i ordered with the paypal money and uh and the case so it was like 140 dollars for everything and then phone doesn't work now it glitched and hasn't been able to work since so I have no phone for right now but I'm gonna post both videos one where I talk about some things and others and uh, so you can hear the difference in me between now and earlier within just a span of 15 minutes I mean it's just it's crazy but peace and much love Spaced Out Productions signing out bye